Hey guys, welcome. It's me Kunal. So in this video, we will going to talk about Google AdWords keyword types. So what are the different types of keywords that we will going to teach you today? And guys, it is very much important. So as I have already told you, what is keyword? Keyword means whatever people search. That is what it is called as keyword. So guys, suppose uh, you have made one course. Okay, you have made one course on digital marketing. So it is your paid course. You want to sell your course, and in return, you want to earn money. So now, guys, suppose um, if we talk about digital marketing course. So guys, you told to Google AdWords that whenever someone will search for digital marketing course keyword, my course should show there, or my advertisement should show there on search results. But but guys, what if someone will going to search for online marketing course? Because see, digital marketing course and both online marketing course are same. They both have same synonyms. So your advertisement can only can also be shown in online marketing course as well. If I will show you life example, just search your digital marketing course. You will going to see that there will be lots of advertisement. But if you will also search for online digital marketing, okay online digital marketing so you will also going to see that there are lots of other advertisement when we have searched for online digital marketing so guys this is the thing about keywords so with the help of keywords you can also manage your advertisement that means you can tell to google hey google show my advertisement only when someone will going to search for digital marketing course you can also tell to google adwords hey google adwords do not show my advertisement when someone will going to search online online marketing course so you can have control over your keywords maybe uh, for some reason you just want to show a uh, digital marketing course keyword or there can be some people who want to show their advertisement in both keyword uh, digital marketing course and online marketing course so suppose there is one person he wants to show his advertisement whenever someone will search for digital marketing course as well as online marketing course so in that case also your advertisement can show if you only want google adwords to show when someone will only search for online marketing course then only you want to show your advertisement so you can also do that so it's totally and totally up to you in which keyword you want to show your advertisement so guys hope you have understood the idea so there are generally four or you can say five type of keyword but in today's video we will going to discuss only about four type of keywords that is broad match keyword broad match modifier face match and exact match so these are the four types of keywords that we will going to discuss in today's video there's also one uh, keyword that is called as negative keyword but in today video we won't talk about negative keyword in next video we will going to cover about negative keyword so guys here you will see in the flowchart i have written a special symbol example keyword in which case it will going to show an example searches that people will going to search for your keyword so this is what we have written here and here as i have told you we have written four type of keyword that is broad match broad match modifier face match and exact match so guys see now we will going to discuss this different type of keywords the reason is because it is very much important for you to know these keywords so that we can apply this type of keywords when we create our campaigns okay so it is very much important to have proper knowledge of keyword otherwise you will going to waste lots of money and people also ignore lots of this stuff because of that they won't be able to generate lots of output with the help of google adwords now friends here you will see broad match so in previous videos if you are following our series or our parts so we have already discussed about broad keywords so broad keywords are it is very general so guys suppose uh, in broad keywords we don't have any symbol like if you will uh, search here uh, by shoes okay so this is a general keyword or you can say uh, broad just write shoes so shoes is a general keyword so when we have searched for shoes so here you can see we have got some shop advertisement as well as shop uh, places location advertisement we have got some blogs on how to wear uh, shoes so it is what it is called as friends broad keyword so broad keyword is a very general and it can be used everywhere you want if we just go to more focus so suppose for example it is men's shoes our keyword is men's shoes so guys if you use this keyword so your ads will also going to show when you misspell this keyword that means suppose you have just uh, written here shoe okay men shoe so if someone will going to search for buy men shoe 
then also your advertisement will going to show okay this is what it is called as misspelling if you uh, go for synonyms if you will see that man man is also known as gentleman okay so if you write gentleman here buy gentleman shoes then also your advertisement will going to show in google ads so this is what it is called as synonyms and if something related to this man shoes or variation then also your keyword will going or your advertisement will going to show like here i have written buy man shoes okay so it is very much related to our keyword man shoes but we have also put buy man shoes or you can also write how to wear man shoes okay so then also your advertisement will going to pop up so hope you have understood the idea of broad match keywords so broad match keywords is a very general keyword and when you use this keyword so your advertisement will show at almost every time so simple now let's talk about exact match keyword so its names only suggest so guys see whenever we uh, do exact match so for example if you will go to our google ads and here if you will search for keywords okay just keep, click on plus so now guys here you will uh, see uh, here if i will write uh, men shoes men shoes so this is a broad keyword but if you will add here this symbol okay this close break uh, close big uh, bracket like i did so it will become exact keyword so simple okay so when we will going to create our campaigns then we will going to teach you how to put keywords but right now you are just understanding the idea okay if i just write men shoes then it will become broad match keyword but when i will add this bracket it will become exact match keyword so now guys question arises what is this exact match keyword so guys see when you will put brackets these big brackets to your opening and closing of keyword then it will become exact match that means you are telling to google that whenever someone will search for this keyword then only show my ads that means if you will go here if someone will write man shoes then only your ads will going to trigger so this is what you are telling to google okay so you have written your keyword and you have told google adwords or google ads that my advertisement will only be shown when someone will just write man shoes okay so if someone will suppose write buy man shoes so your advertisement will not going to show because you have told to google that my keywords or my advertisement will only be shown when it will, when a searcher will going to write man shoes then only my advertisement should show okay but if you write anything else like how to wear man shoes so in if someone will search then also your advertisement will not going to show so it will only going to show when you will write men shoes okay so you are telling to google this so this is possible only when you want to show your advertisement in very specific keyword okay so hope you have understood the idea but in broad keywords whatever someone will search if you do misspellings if you write synonyms or if you write related to your keyword then your advertisement can show easily not a big deal but in exact it is almost opposite only your keyword whenever someone will going to search for your keyword then only your advertisement will show so simple okay so if you want to write exact match keyword so just put this big brackets in beginning and end of your keyword then it will become your exact match keyword now what is this broad match modifier okay so guys you have to add a plus sign in front of your keyword that means suppose uh, if you will see here when you will add plus symbol so it will become your broad uh, match modifier keyword okay so hope you have understood the idea of broad match keyword how we can make any keyword broad match modifier so guys suppose you, your keyword is men shoes and you have put your keyword as broad match modifier by adding plus in front of your keyword so guys see whenever you put this broad match modifier keyword so you are telling to google that our synonym should not pop out here that means guys see in broad match what was happening if someone will going to write here gentleman then also your keyword will going to show but here in this broad match modifier there must be no synonyms that means if you write here gentleman then also your ads will not going to show okay so this is what it is called as broad match modifier okay so synonyms is not allowed here so if someone will just search shoes for men then your advertisement can show but in place of men if you write gentleman so your your advertisement will not going to show so guys some of variations are allowed in this keyword like here i have added for 
okay so this is a very little variation so if someone will search for shoes for men then also my advertisement can show and it can be in any order right here you can see friends in my keyword i have written men first and shoes last but here in my search if someone will search for shoes okay so in uh, you are writing shoes first and men is last then also your ads can show okay and here i have written uh, order can be changed okay any in any order means your keyword order can change then also your advertisement can show so hopefully you have understood the idea it's very simple broad means if you will just search or if you will choose broad keyword your advertisement will show almost every time if you will go for exit keyword so whenever someone will write your exact keyword which you will tell to google then only your advertisement will show but if you will go for a broad match modifier keyword your ads will going to show almost at every time but it should not include any type of synonyms okay double meaning like if you will replace men with gentleman then your ads will not going to show okay so synonyms is not at all allowed here now guys last is phrase match keyword so guys what is this phrase match keyword so guys see in phrase match keyword means you are telling to google that my men shoes should include every time that means see suppose here i write a uh, men shoes okay so you are you have, if you have chosen phrase match keyword so in phrase match keyword you have to add these commas okay so if you will go to google and here if you will add this commas then it will become your phrase key keyword so guys this uh, keyword means that your this men shoes must be included but that means if someone will write men shoes wear then your advertisement will show that means this men shoes must be included inside every search like if you will write here buy men shoes then also your ads will going to show so this men shoes must be included in keyword then at every case your advertisement will going to show but if you will uh, replace the order that means if you will sh write shoes first men later then your advertisement will not going to show okay so it must be in only this form men shoes okay so in all the men shoes case uh, your advertisement will going to show so simple that means uh, if you want to add something in front of men shoes and if you want to add some uh, at last of men shoes that means after men shoes if you want to add something then also your advertisement will going to show that means this men shoes must be included in this form only so simple so if we revise broad match means your advertisement will show almost at every case in exact only your whenever someone will just search for your keyword then only your advertisement will show in broad match modifier what happened is that your advertisement will going to show almost at every case but it should not include any synonyms so simple phrase match means your keyword will show every time whenever it is in this form when men shoes okay if you will add anything at beginning or last of this keyword then also your keyword will going to show so it must be in only this form so guys hope you have understood the idea of different types of keywords so guys these keywords can help you very much and help you to run a very successful campaigns okay because see if you will add proper type of keyword so it will only be beneficial for your business okay so uh, suppose if you want uh, exact match so you can just uh, choose digital marketing course as your exact uh, case that means suppose if here i write uh, digital marketing and i put this big bracket here so i'm just telling to google whenever someone will just search for digital marketing course then only show my advertisement if he will write anything uh, digital marketing course in india or blah blah then my ads will not going to show so hope you have understood the idea so it will help you to uh, run a profitable advertisement and will going to save lots of money of yours and it will also going to give you lots of better output okay so this was all about today's video guys i will see in the next video where we will going to talk about negative keywords